My name's Lenny, and I'm a black lion tamarind. I live in the woods at Jersey Zoo with my mum, dad, brothers and sisters. We share the woods with the marmosets. They're the small, bossy ones, but don't tell them I said that. We live at the zoo because we're critically endangered monkeys. That means that there are hardly any of us living free in the wild. I love living at the zoo. We've got trees to climb. Dominic and the other keepers come in every day to give us our breakfast and tea, and we've got a heated hut that we can use when it gets cold. Ever since I was a baby, my mum's been telling me stories about my cousin. He lives a long way away from Jersey in the Atlantic rainforest in a country called Brazil. His name is Miko, which means monkey in Portuguese. Mum tells me that that's the language Miko speaks in Brazil. When I'm older, I'd really like to go and find Miko. My mum says we can't visit our relations there at the moment because there isn't enough forest for us to play in. There used to be lots of trees in the Atlantic rainforest for black lion tamarinds to climb, but then lots of trees were cut down so that farmers could keep cows and grow sugar. That's sugar growing right there. When the trees were cut down, Miko and my aunt and uncle got stuck in a really small area of the forest. It means they can't see their friends anymore because they're stranded in another small forest. Miko needs to be able to mix with other tamarinds when he's older so that he can have tamarind babies of his own. is people who live close to the forests are working really hard to make sure that Miko will see his friends again. They've started to plant trees in corridors so that all the black lion tamarinds will one day be able to meet up. And if they meet up and breed, we won't be critically endangered anymore. In schools close to Miko's forest, Children are learning all about us black lion tamarinds and how everyone needs to look after the forest and make sure that as many trees are replanted as possible. And even though we're a really long way away here in Jersey, you can all do something to help too. And it's something really easy. You just need to collect your aluminium drink cans so that they can be recycled. For every 50 cans that are collected, Jersey Zoo will arrange for a tree to be replanted close to where Miko lives. So far, children in Jersey have collected enough cans to plant trees to fill the size of 16 football pitches. That's really great, but you all need to keep the project going so please help us black lion tamarinds and get collecting. And one day my dream will come true and I'll get to find my cousin Miko.